Welcome back everybody to Beta SMP. I'm your host, Bobo, and today in this episode we are going to be throwing wheat everywhere and just growing wheat everywhere. There are some mobs in the background annoying me, so we're gonna turn those things down. So yes. Um if you take a look here, look inside my inventory and stuff, we have been inside the nether, because we have tons of nether rack and stuff. But I recorded a episode previously, which I have, but it's really useless because it's a funny story actually. Okay, boom. You guys ready? Let's see where this brings us. Please don't bring us in a cave. Sweet. Uh, extreme hills, really? What's up with all this? Oh, I guess it teleported through. <laughs> I just realized when I put things inside the chest, I put them all at the bottom, so I dragged everything in. I built this portal here. I went inside the nether, found a house with the portal. And then I placed everything there. I never showed my cords once, so I think you guys can see where this is going. Then I, t then I was watching Astro's video later, and he built a portal too to get to his place. But he built it like on the opposite side of the nether. And for some reason, most of the portals inside the nether link up to Astro's house. But yeah, so I lost all my diamonds and stuff inside my chest, so... Eventually one day on like episode like 25, we're going to find those things. We're gonna find my chest that I left and then we'll have six more diamonds that I had inside the chest. I think I had six. Okay, so what my plan is, I don't, whoa, why is there a hole? My bad, sorry. Give me a second, one, two, nobody go there. So my plans today, and I don't understand why that's there, sorry. My plans today are, I need to go get some wood because I have no wood, I left it at my old house. So we are going to do that. This is kind of our, our chest, like, I put this chest here for me to place things, but I never picked it back, picked it back up, so I'm going to go grab some wood, hopefully I didn't already have an axe. And this looks like a forest kind of place over here that we can get wood from. So we'll grab wood and we'll be right back. Okay, so it's nighttime now, and we have a stack and a quarter of logs. I also just want to show over here Galaxy Gun's horse, Peanut. Hi, Peanut. How's it going? Yeah, I'm doing pretty good myself. How, how about you? Just being a horse, I see. Okay. So this right here is Camo's. Camo's Flea Market. And it's coming soon. I'm guessing it's going to really come soon once... Um, once we really get spawn set up and we have more shops and stuff. <laughs> this is quite a location to have it. There's nothing inside these chests. But yeah, so he's advertising this flea market, getting that ready to go out and up for sale. Well, not up for sale, but start being able to have construction on it and stuff. But yes, what our plans to do is we want a location to have a shop because we need to put like dibs on this place before somebody takes it before us. So first we're going to see if these cows want more wheat, which they do. So they'll breed for it. How about the sheep? They'll all get it in, sounds good. Oh, we want the XP from them. Thank you. Do you guys have XP? Nope. Okay, anything inside here that we- Oh, we'll take those logs, thank you. Nobody saw that, right? So my idea what I want done with the shop, this is going to be pretty difficult considering the fact that all these mobs and stuff are around. This creeper's going to blow. Okay, so this looks like a pretty good location to have something without flattening down land. We don't really need a big hut or anything for this. I'm not going to tell you guys what we need yet, but we're going to get this and have a nice little tiny square. This is gonna be very difficult with mobs. So let's just cut down this grass. Okay, so 
cleared out the area of grass. Which, I just like nice clear land that looks stupid and stuff, but still. We need a good location. It can't be too close to the flea market. But we need, like, room in between. I'm not sure if we're gonna have, like, roads or anything through. So we'll give it a nice little 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. We got a nice 7 space. What's that? That's 5, right? So we'll have 5 like that, 7, 8, 9. We can have like a 10 by 10 thing, can't we? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Okay, and then we need to connect these, which we will only need 8. Let's do that. Is that a square? Yeah, that's a square. Um, it'd be nice to have a bigger shop, but for now we can just claim this area and maybe we can expand like downstairs if we need to. So what I'm going to do is clear up this and then we will claim the land with a better tactic so it looks a little more claimed than it's, that we're actually building it. It doesn't look like a house. Because we're not actually going to build it with wood. Because wood doesn't look the greatest when it comes to building. And considering Camel already laid down the platform of what spawn's gonna look like, having that flea market there. So guys, we're going to do something that I'm pretty sure another S um, Cube SMP does this to claim plots. I don't know if anything else does, but it's a pretty obvious one. Yeah, I just made buttons. This is how we're gonna claim our little tiny land that we have. I'm no pro with buttons, but okay, they don't change directions. I didn't do that. I'm gonna kill this guy. Sneak up on him. Ah, kill him! Kill him! Kill him! Give me an ender pearl! He didn't give me an ender pearl. That's sad. But yes. Let's keep on doing this. One. Two. Okay, so we got a nice little tiny... Uh, we kind of want this bigger, so... Could have still expanded it a little more. But this is fine. This is a good enough area. Um, we don't really need these buttons, so... Um, let's be nice and plop some on this workbench. Can't plop them on chests, okay. That's actually really cool, having buttons on the workbench. Um, where else? Camo, um... If you don't like my present, I'm oh, sorry man, but you need a present. We do need a sign. I'm not going to take a sign from here, actually. We need to do a couple things. So we'll have our workbench in here. <laughs> we should have made a trapdoor. So the company name is going to be called Bo. Bo, you ready for this? Bo Bo Beats. Should we do a Z or an S? I don't know. Z or an S? We'll exaggerate the S. Bo Bo Beats. Um. Coming soon. To a theater. The theater. Theater. Yeah, that's how you spell it, right? Theater? Yeah. We're not gonna have that. Coming soon... ...to beta. SMP. Nah, we'll just have... ...Bobo Beats... ...and we'll, we will exaggerate this S. The only thing with, like, making signs and stuff, like, pixel art with signs, is... ...I hate making Bs. I don't really know how to make Bs. So... I have to exaggerate this. Um... Just in case somebody wants to buy it, to buy land, contact Bobo. Because this is a pretty nice chunk of land, it's right beside the flea market. Oh, I never really mentioned what we're going to be selling here. Um, my plan is this is going to be a regular shop, it's just called Bobo Beats, because short form can be BBB. If you guys can think of anything else, you can tell me in the comments, and we'll call it Bobo Beef if we want to sell food. <laughs> That's a good one, Bobo Beef. You want to sell food um yeah this is my chest but boa beats as in like music we have these all these cds i actually got another one too while i was giving wood 
actually I might have got this beforehand, but yeah, we have all these CDs and stuff. So like, that can be like our theme for the shop. For the shop, we can make it like a music store, but we'll sell anything else really. And yeah. So I do need to find a house area, like a new house area, because I lost my last house. So maybe we can go inside the nether, go a totally di different direction. Maybe we won't connect to Astro's house this time. Hopefully not. This is our little tiny nether hub. Oh, what's down here? Oh, it's a road. I don't want to get trapped going. I don't want to get lost. Oh god, that was stupid. How far does lava spread down? Not that far. Okay. So. People, people, people. We're gonna go a totally different direction. We're going to want to... We're gonna go upwards. Maybe we can, like, get into mountains and stuff. I think that's how nether portals work. So, maybe if we do a little bit of caving. We do need to kind of be careful, so we're gonna have this nether, nether rack on our heart bar getting ready to place it down if we hit lava. Oh, we're, like, right at the top. Maybe we need to go down. I don't know. I'm gonna keep this area. Um, I'm not sure. I'm not really sure where we want to go up to the top of the uh, nether and stuff. So we'll go down though. Plus this is better, lava won't really... Can't really get trapped by lava, because lava spreads really fast inside the nether. For all you noobs out there. We hit it guys. We hit the nether. Welcome to the actual nether. We do need some quartz, because I don't really know what type of blocks I'm going to build the shop out of yet. be nice to have some quartz before everybody steals ones that are close and stuff, instead of having to mine for all of them. Hopefully this brings us somewhere else besides where we have already been. Please don't bring us to Astros, I beg you. Please, portal gods, please. I'm not looking, guys. I'm not looking. Okay, wait, let me step out of this portal. Okay, um, I'm gonna look at three, two, one! Whoa, we're in a totally different location. This actually, this looks like it can be good, like... Okay, we got a nice little mine here. We should go find some iron in a bit. But let's scan out this area real quick. See what we got, like, coming for us. Like, we got this spruce biome area. Hmm. not really sure what to think of this like there's a ravine there it doesn't look that good hmm. I think this can do maybe ouch maybe though just maybe I like where to go where to go I need to get up on here let me set I like that mountain, it looks really... looks different. It doesn't look like all the other mountains I've ever seen. Okay, so we'll set up there. Oh god! Okay, it didn't kill me. I got a little bit of lag there once it blew up. I hear something. I got a feeling something's watching me. Yeah, that was actually attempted to quote Michael J. Oh, I was just wondering what poisoned me. I got poisoned. I'm like, no, 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 no. And I realized, oh, yeah, I ate that spider eye. Oh, it blew up our portal. Hopefully it doesn't bring us to a new location. I don't think that happens, but... We're back here. need to do something about this too. We're gonna want stairs to get up faster. But yes, we need to go on a quick mining trip and this is probably the best location because spawn is like all mined out and stuff. We'll make sure not to 
hang out too much by this person's house. So we'll go a little further away. Uh, let's just show our chords. Okay, thank you. Just had to put that for the video. Oh, what is this? Oh, guys, 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 guys. You are right by Nate in eyes base. So um, can you leave or move farther away? Too close to us, Ant. I was here first. This, this is my stuff, guys. We found my stuff. We found, we found everything we've been working towards. My God. We found our things. That this was like the goal of. Ah, scared me, sir. We're gonna put our portal right here. Please take us to a new location. And don't script the other portals, please. I like this. This looks good. Please, no house over the horizon. Oh, we're right by a village and so many sheep and everything. I love this place. We're keeping this place. And we're going to travel to... Uh, look at this. Somebody has already been here. And creep or something. And things have been destroyed and... But nobody has anything claimed. And if they did, they killed, they killed like villagers with it. Oh, that's not good. Well, not good for me. Like it's good because people are living here. But somebody could be living over that way, or in here. No, oh, they trapped in the villagers. There's only oh, they did trades with them and stuff. Okay, so 21 coal for an emerald and 6 emeralds for an iron axe. You're crazy. Oh, this is a good trade. We need definitely to keep this one. This trade's actually... Uh, it's okay. I guess it's not that good. It's just because it's a run flesh trade. But yeah, you guys have to stay trapped in there. Sorry. It's not... I don't make the rules. I just kind of enforce them. Are there any... Oh, there's more villagers trapped. We'll take a look at you guys. Come over. What do you got? 17 string for an emerald? That actually, that's a good trade. That's not a good trade though. Do I have any string I can lend you? No, I already get, got rid of it. Sorry. What do you have? Raw pork chop for an emerald? That's a good one. And the chicken one's a good one too. And the wheat's a really good one. These guys have really good trades. Especially the potatoes and carrots. And there's that trade. We definitely need to keep you people. Yeah. Sorry, guys, but I'm going to have to lock you guys back in here for, you know. I'll have my house close to the village. That's okay. I still haven't scanned out the area for, like, a, another house of any sort. Oh, yeah, I like this location for a house. It's so flat. What's this? Oh, a nice little cave. That looks great, actually. Okay, we'll set this up. Uh, we'll put away our diamonds. And we'll actually put up cords just so we save them. And we'll take a screenshot of those, too, just in case. I'll write them down in a bit. Need to be super organized. I haven't seen my clear inventory like this before. My inventory hasn't been this clear before. Um, I think that's about it that we really need to get rid of. Fight me, bro. Yeah, that's right. You better get taken out. So, I'm back at spawn. I just want to say, I don't really need to breed these sheep anymore because... I don't need them. Like, I have my own house to worry about now with my own sheep that I'm going to start raising and stuff. I do need food, so... Hello. Goodbye. Please die. And did I lose the food? Yeah. No, not the baby, not the baby, not the baby. I just totally lost the food and killed two cows. I didn't think about that. Let's see if it works on sheep. It does work, but... Ooh, come on. Right there. Move. Scram. No. I gotta go see it. No, 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 no. No. Ah! That was not cool. 
We got our second death on the server and nobody to say GG to us. <sighs> that wasn't cool. We did get some food out of it. We almost burnt these sheep to death. But, you know, it's... So mu it's so good if you're, like, lazy to actually do anything. So if you guys enjoyed the episode today of Beta SMP, hit the like button. Um, next episode I'll probably get working on the house a bit. And, yeah, I hope that I'll start working on my shop as soon as, like, we actually get, like, spawn done and stuff. Um, that'd be nice to get done so we can have more collabs and stuff and do some business things that... I don't want to blow up this creeper on here. That I feel really horrible. Um, yeah, the buttons there. So our shop is set up here, I guess. And yeah, it's set up with the buttons. So nobody can build there because we have it claimed with buttons. But yeah, so if you guys enjoyed the video, smack the like button, and I'll see you guys in the next video. We'll end off the video just throwing wheat because that's how we started it. See you guys.